So welcome to the Lead Directorate Academy. Today I will discuss what is our root, mean square, and RMS value, or effective value book. And what is the definition of RMS? The voltage at which the heat produced in a DC circuit is equal to heat produced in an AC circuit provided the resistance value is same. The resistance value is same and uh, it is operating in the same time period. The heat produced in a DC circuit is equal to I square RT. So where I is called the RMS value. Where I is called the RMS value of the current. RMS value. So I am taking the sine side of the waveform. So this is the current waveform where I is equal to I m sin omega t. I square means the negative of cycle is converted into positive of cycle. And this is 0 to pi 2 pi and this is the I square waveform. The, all the negative values are converted into positive values. Why? Because it's a negative of cycle. Negative of square is positive value. This is the I square waveform. For this, the time period is pi. So now I am taking only positive of cycle. Why? Because uh, negative of cycle is converted into positive of cycle, and then now the time period is changed for I square. And this section, this waveform is divided into n equal intervals of time this is divided as n equivalent equal intervals of time suppose for total time period is t now and this will be divided as t by n and this is also t by n this is t by n and t by n t by n so on t by n so at first position the instantaneous value is I1 and here it is I2 at uh, T3 I3 and after that it is I4 so after that it is I5 and like that so T1 is equal to T2 is equal to T3 is equal to so on Tn is equal to T by n so this is uh, T1 and this point is T2 this point is T3, this point is T4, so on Tn. The positive of cycle can be divided in equal intervals of time. The heat produced at T1, heat produced at T1 is equal to the instantaneous value is I1. So I1 square R into T1. So what is the T1 value is T divided by N. Heat produced at T2 is equal to I2 square R T2 that is I2 square R into T by N. And similarly the heat produced at Tn is equal to In square R into T by N sorry that is Tn anyway it is T by N only Tn is equal to In square R into T divided by N now the heat produced in an AC circuit heat produced in an AC circuit is equal to the sum of the heat produced of these values that is I1 square R T by N plus I2 square R into T by N plus I3 square R into T by N plus so on I N square into R into T divided by N. 
So as per the RMS value definition, heat produced in DC circuit is equal to heat produced in an AC circuit. So this is capital I square RT. You know that uh, the instantaneous values of the currents are represented with small letter. So I1 square RT by N plus I2 square R into T by N plus I3 square into R into T by N plus so on. I n square into R into T by n and take R T is common I 1 square plus I 2 square I 3 square so on I n square divided by n on left side R T and right side R T both are cancelled now the I R M S is equal to under root of I1 square plus I2 square plus I3 square so on I n square divided by n. So this method is called the graphical method. This method is called the graphical method. Once again the voltage at which heat produced in DC circuit is equal to heat produced in AC circuit provided with same resistance and uh, it is operating at same time period. Finally, the IRMS is equal to under root of I1 square plus I2 square plus I3 square so on IN square divided by N. So root mean squares, first of all, you should make the squares, squares after that mean. So mean means I1 square plus I square plus I3 square plus so on I n square divided by n. Then you can apply the root. So root mean square. Square of all the terms and then you can apply mean. After that you can apply root. So this is a graphical method.